Hey guys, what's up? Coach Urban here. I'm getting ready to go over Saturday's workout. Obviously, you guys know it's Murph Prep. Um, I hope everybody had a great week. I hope everybody's body is feeling good. If not, okay, make sure you're modifying uh, or making the proper adjustments in your training to make sure that you guys are staying healthy and uh, that you guys uh, stay moving, okay? And not just physically, but also mentally, okay? So, um, so yeah, yeah. So, yeah, with, with that, let's go over this workout, right? Okay, so 15 rounds for time, okay, with the vest, okay? Five pull-ups, nine push-ups, 200-meter run, okay? No squatting today. We did a lot of squatting yesterday, right? So, we're going to take a break on those knees. Um, as far as knee flexion uh, goes, um, if you are doing this, if you, if you do plan to do Murph with a vest, make sure you're doing this workout with the vest, okay? Um, if you're building yourself up to doing it with the vest, maybe you say, hey, you know what? I'm doing half the volume with the vest, and then I'm, then I'm taking the vest off and I'm doing the other half with, with, um, uh, without the vest, right? Or maybe you're not doing it with the full 20 pounds, right? Maybe you're doing it with 10 pounds and then you're increasing the weight as well. So again, there's different ways here to do, to skin the cat, right? Um, but you know, you want to make sure that you're working up towards, um, towards getting better, um, and getting that muscular endurance, uh, to be able to tackle that, that, that Murph. Okay. So if you guys notice, we went down in rounds and now we went up in volume, right? At each uh movement which which is gonna require more muscular endurance right so you got a higher rep scheme so that means that you know you got to have more endurance in that certain muscle group to be able to perform right that um that movement okay you know so five pull-ups nine push-ups and 200 meter run okay um what else substitutions for the pull-ups right dumbbell upright rows right so dumbbell upright rows if you don't have a pull-up bar okay or pillowcase pillowcase body row um we um introduced this movement earlier in the week so you know if you liked it and uh you don't have access to a pull-up bar for whatever reason um you know the the, the that pillow body row uh we we used the towel so that worked better it was a little bit longer so again um you know, if you can't find a pull-up bar, you gotta make do, right? So, uh, so that's the subs for the pull-ups. You know, remember we are doing this workout on the weekend, so I purposely do want you to go out and try to find a pull-up bar at a park or something. So, um, you know, try to make an effort to do that, okay? Especially if you are going to be doing pull-ups for the workout. Uh, and then the push-ups right on your knees, okay? So start off your knees, and then eventually, if you gotta get on your knees, then do it, okay? So. Um, other than that, guys, that's all I got today. Uh, have a great day. Have a great weekend. Uh, post your scores on Sugar Wad. Fist pump somebody. Um, and we'll see you guys hopefully on our Zoom call on Sunday at 1 p.m. Peace.